Hey everyone, welcome back to Error Genie. If you're encountering the Marvel Rivals error code 220, don't worry. I'll guide you through simple, step-by-step -step solutions to resolve this issue. Watch until the end and let's get started. Step one, change your DNS settings. Sometimes network issues cause error code 220. Fix it by adjusting your DNS. Go to the search bar on your PC and type control panel, open network and sharing center. Click on Change Adapter Settings on the left-hand side. Right-click on your active internet connection, Wi-Fi or Ethernet, and select Properties. Select Internet Protocol version 4, TCP slash IPv4, and click Properties. Change the DNS server to Preferred DNS Server, 8.8.8.8 Alternate DNS Server, 8.8.4.4. Click OK, then restart your game to check if the error is resolved. Step 2. Disable real-time protection temporarily. Sometimes your antivirus software might interfere with the game. Go to the search bar and type Windows Security. Select Virus and Threat Protection. Scroll down and click on Manage Settings under Virus and Threat Protection Settings. Toggle real-time protection to off. Important. Turn this back on after checking if the issue is fixed. Step 3. Update your graphics driver. Outdated drivers can cause errors like this. Here's how to update them. Go to the search bar and type Device Manager. Expand Display Adapters. Right-click your graphics driver, e.g. NVIDIA or AMD, and select Update Driver. Choose Search Automatically for Drivers and let it update. Restart your PC after updating and launch the game again. Step 4. Check Marvel Rivals server status. If the problem persists, the issue might be with the game servers. Visit the official Marvel Rivals Twitter account or their website. Look for any updates regarding server maintenance or outages. If servers are down, all you can do is wait for the developers to fix them. That's it for today's guide on fixing Marvel Rivals error code 220. If this video helped you, don't forget to leave a like, comment, and subscribe to Error Genie for more troubleshooting tips. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next video.